Lenario, Washington. He was arrested last year for the murder of Maria Esquero at an apartment. 27-year-old Brian Clay killed Ignacio Yadira Martinez and her 10-year-old daughter Carla with a claw hammer. Both victims had been raped. <laughs> Completamente. Bueno, ¿y qué quiere hacer la señorita soltera? Hagamos una peda. ¿En qué momento se casaron todos, eh? Y sus responsabilidades. Oh, yeah. A los picados. Los jóvenes no te entienden. La última vez que vine aquí era la lebrije. Y vine a ver a la gusana ciega. ¡Qué padre! ¿Era tu amiga o...? Realmente que somos. Ustedes se les decía quedada. Hazte del rogar. Tú le vas a dar la oportunidad a alguien más. Vas a acabar de hippie solitaria. El reloj biológico no espera. Tía, ¿cuántos años cumples? Treinta. No existe un nombre para lo que es. Hola, Inés. Quería ver si quieres que volvamos a salir o... ¿Qué crees? Que ya estoy saliendo con alguien. A 14-year-old boy shot her, and an 18-year-old, Nashawn Johnson, he was driving the car. Now, police have not said if the shooting was random or if the teens knew the victim. Pamela Cabrillales was found shot in her car. She later died from her injuries. Mamadou Kelly, who is now accused of killing Tierra Rodriguez Diaz, and she and her friend, Kimberly Ortiz Zayas. Michael Cadogan and Gianna Delgado got into some sort of an argument before Cadogan assaulted her, resulting in her death. Cadogan admitted to strangling his girlfriend, Delgado, with a plan to get rid of the car and her body in Watuga Lake. Police say they were able to track down 23-year-old Anthony Crawford thanks to surveillance video. Wendy Martinez was stabbed to death Tuesday in what detectives are calling a random act of violence. Her mother says the 35-year-old will be buried in her wedding dress that she just picked out over the weekend after being engaged last week.